They have been drinking human blood since antiquity. I say, do you know? Their itchy red welts were as common as the common cold until five decades of blissful bed buglessness. And now they're back. So, exactly how big is the bed bug pandemic? It's huge. Today, one in five Americans have either had bed bugs or they know someone who's encountered them. What gives bed bugs their super spawning powers? Three things. First, they're non discriminating, equal opportunity pests. Rich, poor, clean, crummy, vegan, or carnivore, bed bugs love everyone. Two, they are expert stowaways. Put your bag down on the wrong chair somewhere, and it is all aboard the train to your place. Three, bed bugs are coy and elusive. Tiny lentil sized vampires that prefer to only come out at night. And that's why so many people don't even know they have them. Until it's a full-fledged infestation. If it happens to you, don't panic. Call a licensed pest professional. Bed bugs are not a do-it-yourself project. That's right. In fact, doing it yourself can have disastrous consequences, like literally having to throw away all of your furniture, your carpets, and your beds. A professional can help you banish bed bugs and avoid such drastic measures. Now, let's learn how to stop bed bugs from finding you in the first place. Lots of homeowners call in professionals as a precautionary measure. An expert can help you guard against all kinds of common invaders, not just bed bugs. Buzz off. You can pick up bed bugs anywhere. Planes, dorms, daycares, offices, taxis, health clubs, hospitals. They even hit famous tourist attractions like the Empire State Building. And you thought King Kong was a problem. Hotels, even fancy ones, are another favorite bed bug stop. Here are 10 tips for preventing bed bugs. First, know the signs. Bed bugs can shed their skin or leave pepper like spots on surfaces. If you see debris between your mattresses or in other crevices, don't assume it's just crumbs or dirt. Investigate. Change your bed linens often and stay on the lookout for evidence. Inspect hotel rooms before you settle in. Keep your bags as far from furniture, walls, or carpet as possible. Bathroom tile is your safest bed. Inspect the bed and furniture. Remember, bed bugs are not just in beds. Even if the coast is clear, you just never know. When you get home, inspect your suitcase. Bring your clothes home in a plastic bag, then wash and dry them on high heat. Watch out for antiques and secondhand furniture. Examine them too, before bringing them home. Inspect new clothes before you leave a store, and wash them before putting them away. Wherever you go, keep your bags and things off the floor when you can. Declutter. Then if bed bugs do get in, you can more easily detect them, call a professional, and avert a crisis. If you see or feel anything suspicious, don't ignore it. Sleeping in a different room will just expand their territory. Bed bugs find you by following the carbon dioxide you exhale. So unless you plan on holding your breath for a really long time, they will find you. <laughs> so if you suspect you have bed bugs, call a pest professional immediately and follow their instructions. Repeat, bed bugs are not DIY projects. Now that you're an expert bed bug behavioralist, tell your friends and family to watch this video. The only way we can put those buggers out of business is to spread the word and work together. To learn even more about bed bugs and how to protect your home and family, check out pestworld.org.